Hello, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's Saturday Fragrance Shakedown. So today for you, I have the Ulta Fall Leaves um, Body Mist and Body Lotion. So if you'd like to hear about these products, including prices and notes, then please keep on watching. Um, like it said, I do upload a daily video all about budget beauty, so make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell, heck, even bookmark the page, that way you can come back every single day and watch. I also do a live stream every Sunday night at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So come hang out, come chat with me. I really do love getting to know my viewers and subscribers. Okay, so I'm sorry, I'm in a fall mood. I know we're still in August. It's still super hot in a lot of places. You know, last week we were in triple digits here in Northern Utah. We're still in the high 90s here, but I don't know, I'm just having some fall feels. So. I wanted to talk about these, but yeah, so these are um, from Ulta, and this is my first like fragrance mist perfume that I've tried from the Ulta brand, but Fall Leaves. So this is a six fluid ounce body spray and then a 10 fluid ounce body lotion, and it does match. I do have to say, I think the artwork is absolutely beautiful. So, so pretty. Okay, so I did a little bit of research, and this is actually from Ulta's website. So. Um, the fragrance notes are apricot nectar, um, mimosa petals, golden leaves, and sheer amber. So a little bit musky, um, a little bit fruity with the apricot. So sounds perfect. So it's a strong mister. So it is a little bit powerful. It's not like a super fine mist like Bath and Body Works, but it's still a good mister. Just it's a little strong. Okay, so we're just gonna let that sit for a minute. And I've, I tried the body spray last night when I got out of the shower, but I haven't tried the body lotion. I wanna see if they do smell the same, because sometimes they don't. But, oh yeah, this does. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and put a little bit of this on. Pretty color, it's like a light lavender. Mm, that smells good. It's thin, but it's not... You know how some cheap lotions, they're super thin and they actually can make your skin feel drier than before you put on body lotion? This isn't like that. It's thin and it does seem to be like melting in quickly. It does have a scent, but it isn't as strong as the body mist, which I'm fine with. Lots of um, perfumed body lotions are like that. They're not as potent as like the body spray or the perfume and that's how this um, Ulta body lotion is like but it does smell good I'm just gonna let everything just kind of mingle for a second but just so you know they do have matching hand soap and candles so um, they do have a whole bunch of other stuff that goes with this fragrance as well which I only have the body mist and then the lotion but Okay, so I was expecting it to be a little bit more fruity. I can really smell like that amber. It smells pretty musky on me, which a lot of fragrances do do that on me. They, I don't know, something about my chemistry just kind of really pulls out those warm notes and like the musky earthy scent. It smells really, really good though. It's not super strong. Um, if you know, it's not as strong as like Bath and Body Works or Victoria's Secrets, but it still smells really good and it has a nice, it does have a really nice scent. So I did get these on sale, but right now they're around $6 a piece, which I don't think is bad at all. Um, I think they're really nice. Yeah, it smells really, smells really, really good. It totally reminds me of a really expensive perfume I actually own just like in a little sample, but I can't remember what it is. But it almost smells a little chocolatey. There is a chocolate in it, but I think it's maybe like the nectar and the amber and like the leaf scent. It just, it pulls really warm on me. It smells really, really good. Um, I know that they do have pumpkin spice right now on sale. I'm doing a no-buy, but 
yeah, I'm not disappointed by these. They're, like I said, it's not as high a quality as Bath & Body Works, but for the price, I think these are really good, especially if you can find them on sale. Smells really, really good. I like these a lot. I'm glad I picked them up when they were on sale. I got them for like a dollar a piece, a dollar something a piece. So definitely worth the money. So if you do find any of the Ulta like body mist on sale, I would definitely recommend picking them up because it does smell really good and it does have enough scent. And I do have to say, like I said, I did try try this last night after I got out of the shower and I could sm still smell it this morning. So where it's a lighter fragrance, it's not super potent, it definitely does linger, which is nice. So maybe if you're someone that doesn't like a very strong scent, you might really, really like these. So definitely recommend. It smells really good. I'm excited to have these for fall. But anyway, there is my short and sweet little Saturday fragrance shakedown. I'm really impressed with the Ulta um, perfume and body lotion. I was very, very surprised because I was expecting it to be kind of Dollar Tree-ish. You know what I mean? I like the perfumes that I've picked up a few body sprays that are really nice, but a lot of times the Dollar Tree stuff is kind of lackluster. I was kind of expecting that with these, but totally not that way. Just a lighter fragrance. So that sounds up your alley. There you go. But anyway, um, I hope you did enjoy um, today's video. If you did, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and share it. I'd super duper appreciate it. I would love to know down below in the comments if you've ever tried any of the Ulta body mists. What did you think? Were you impressed? Were you disappointed? Let me know down below in the comments. And just so you know, I um, do have a Macari page where I sell discount makeup, beauty, skincare. I also have another YouTube channel where I upload seven days a week all about budget food. And I also have a Facebook group where we just kind of hang out and post pictures of our makeup looks and just chat and stuff. I'll have all three of those linked down below if you're interested, but yeah. Um, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all at Budget Glam Babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video of Shit Star Auto Plane here very shortly, or you can always click on one of the ones I'll be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.